Hello Scorpio and welcome to your September 2019 future love reading. This is for Scorpio. Scorpio, you can now find me on Instagram, on Facebook, and on Twitter at SecretTarot1111. And I will leave those links down below in the description box. All right, Scorpio, I know I'm reading this towards the end of September 2019, but please keep in mind that time is fluid, so you could be dealing with this situation right now, right? Or in the future, a month from now, two months from now, so on and so forth. So let's see what is going on with your future love. This is for Scorpio's future love. What is going on with Scorpio's future love? What is going on? Ooh, very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. And give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. So somebody wants a chance with you, Scorpio. <laughs> Clearly, right? And you're going to have to make a decision on that. And um, it's like they know that it's going to be up to you to decide if you want to give this a go, right? If you want to give it a shot here, give them a shot. Uh, so let's see where this is going. This is for Scorpio for September 2019 future love reading. Scorpio, if this resonates with you, please like, share, and subscribe and leave me a comment. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you at all, Scorpio, please do check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign as this will not resonate with every Scorpio out there. Please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable. So however it resonates with you. This is for Scorpio, September 2019. Future love reading. What is going on with Scorpio's future love? What is going on with Scorpio's future? Ooh, okay. All right. Yeah, big decision here. All right, so definitely want to reconnect. Definitely want to work on things with you. So we're going to have to make a decision on this. Um, some of you are going to, you know, want to reconnect with somebody. Some of you don't. But this person is certainly going to come back and try to heal the situation with you, Scorpio. We have Temperance card. This is Sagittarius energy. A lot of major arcana here on the table already, but I'm going to read the energy of the cards. If the sign of the person that you are dealing with, have dealt with, or will be dealing with in the future, like I said before, time is fluid. If their sign pops up, all the better. Uh, keep in mind the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable, right? So let's get into it. Patience, right? Finding balance in a situation trying to heal the situation, wanting to reconnect, wanting to fix things. They want to fix things, Scorpio. Okay? That's what they're wishing for. Another major arcana, the star card. They definitely want that balance. Do you see? They definitely want balance. This is another very healing card. They feel like it's fate. They feel like it's destiny. Um, they're wishing to... Um, fix things with you and to progress in the right direction that is their wish um they know that um you may take your time with this with this hangman another major arcana so this is going to be a major decision for you okay um the hangman here maybe you've been stalling a little bit or or kind of holding back keeping your hands to yourself kind of a thing in regards to this person right you see how he's got his hands behind his back here but um they're just kind of waiting waiting on a decision waiting to see if you're going to give them a chance to balance the situation to fix the situation to heal the situation here yeah you left them out in the cold wow okay so they feel very alone they feel ghosted and keep in mind these energies can be vice versa or interchangeable um, five of pentacles here that's earth energy taurus virgo capricorn so they feel shut out they feel alone they feel left out in the cold and here they are you know 
they're just waiting on some kind of answer to see if you will give them another shot or not. They want to fix this, all right? So that is what is going on. And look at that, right behind there, another five of cups, that's water. They have a lot of regrets in the situation. Um, a lot of sadness here, a lot of, um, I wanna say depression. Five of cups, that's water energy, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. They don't want this to be like it is, okay? They definitely want to fix it. I feel like they have some regrets and they want you to give them another shot. They want to come in from out of the cold, okay? So the situation, they're trying to get control of the situation here, okay? We have Aries energy with the emperor. Um, this person could be older than you or you could be older than them, however you want to uh, apply it to your situation. This person uh, is trying to get uh, control back of the situation. I feel like it was very dramatic but they want to offer you loyalty. They want to offer you protection. And um, it's a very um, dominating energy right there, kind of controlling energy. But their feelings towards you, Scorpio, we got the lover's card. So they know that there are soul ties here. They, they feel soulmate, twin flame type energy when they are with you, but they know that you're going to have to make a decision. They want you to follow your heart, Gemini energy here. So they want you to follow your heart um, and allow them to come back into your space to try to smooth the situation over and to heal it. The challenges here is the four of pentacles so they're they have they are having a hard time letting go of the situation there definitely could be some money issues here with these two cards between the two of you or money ties but um four of pentacles i feel like the challenge is number one they're having a hard time letting go of the situation with you number two they're having a hard time getting to your heart okay because you've got your heart blocked towards them you're protecting your heart in regards to this situation okay so four of pentacles that's more earth energy there and then the actions they will take they will take the slow progressive action towards you they will nurture the situation as the empress would okay now keep in mind here we have the emperor and we have the empress so this is the divine masculine the divine feminine and then look so yes, this is a very strong connection that you share with this individual, okay? Um, you could be, um, uh, you could have a family together. This could be representing the father figure, the mother figure, that kind of thing. Um, but all in all, they're trying to get control back of the situation here. And with the Empress card here, the actions that they are going to take, it they are going to nurture the situation with you okay they're going to put in effort and they're going to take their time with it it could be very you know a slow progression to get back to where the two of you once were but they do want that chance okay they do want that chance the outcome here is the ace of swords and um this is by the way libra taurus energy and i wanted to point that out because Libra uh, got the Ace of Swords in the same position in their reading. But Ace of Swords, this is Air, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. So I feel like there's going to be a victory here. I feel like there's going to be at least communication, very clear communication between you and this individual. So a truthful new beginning is possible should you, should you allow this um, individual back into your heart. So let's clarify that Ace of Swords for Scorpio for September 2019 future love reading. What is going on with Scorpio's future love? What is going on with Scorpio's future love? Yeah, look at that. And they're manifesting here. I feel like you cut them off here with this King of Swords energy that's Air, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Um, this is an individual that um, is trying to think with their head and putting emotions aside. 
they want clarity here they they need um, clarity in a situation and you know they got swords are up swords are up so I feel like yes you kind of went hardcore towards this individual you kind of went cold towards them and left them out in the cold but they most definitely want to warm the situation they want to warm your heart towards them and they do want to heal the situation here they do want to talk um, King of Swords is all about communication and so is this I, I, there is at least going to be I feel a conversation for some of you to try to get clear here and try to make clear decisions in regards to this situation right so we have the magician here so they are trying to manifest a new beginning with you Libra got this also and this is um, another major arcana so they want to fix it. They want to nurture it. They want you to follow your heart. They know the connection here. It's the emperor, the empress. This is a divine connection. That's how they're feeling about the situation with you. Definitely a lot of healing cards here for you, Scorpio, in regards to this individual. So the choice is ultimately going to be yours, but um, this is what this person wants and they could be coming in very soon to have a conversation you know in regards to this situation to get clear and make clear decisions on you know what we want to do about this situation here all right scorpio that is your september 2019 future love reading um like i said at the beginning of the video you can now find me on facebook instagram and Twitter at Secret Tarot 1111 and all that information is down below in the description box. You can also find that information in my about section of my channel. There you can also find a weekly schedule to see when your weekly reading will be released. I am a little bit, I'm about a day behind. I wasn't feeling very well yesterday, so I'm a day behind schedule. So my apologies for that. Um, but usually we stick to that schedule um, pretty well. Um, you can also find the live schedule there. I go live every day, but uh, Saturday, uh, usually around noon Eastern Standard Time. And then next week, I will be working on the end of the year forecast um, for everyone. Everyone, I, I put a poll out and everyone voted on the reading that they wanted to see. At least like a bonus series. We had a little extra time. So we're going to do an end of the year forecast next week. And I'll be working on that. All right, Scorpio. And that is your reading for this week. I hope you have enjoyed it. Very interesting. Um, ultimately, the decision is most definitely yours. So um, you guys have a great week. And you take very good care of yourself. And I will talk to you soon. Okay? Take care. And God bless.